Hello YouTube, Russ the Must here and welcome to part 10 of Goodbye Deponia. We're trying to clone Goal and the Grim Reaper guy so we can get further. Oh, not a chance. It's totally rusted shot. Oh, it's just one obstacle. Can I use the olive oil? <laughs> there we go! It actually worked! This is incredible! Could it be that I have just discovered a way to make use of olives? Olives are a head of use surface. So don't be giving me that. Alright, let's take some fryer grease. Bag of fries. Swillow fizz. Swillow fizz. What this is that? This to be my favorite soda. I always liked how they made it glow in the dark. And it still glows when you pee. That's weird. There's something wrong with that soda. Ionized salt. <laughs> Good thing salt doesn't come with a use-by date. Otherwise, this rust red color <coughs> might make me think twice. Hmm. Is that all I needed? Out of this little area. Looks like it. All right. Let's go back into the cloning lab area. <coughs> hmm. Now, bag ah, of fries. The greasy XXL, my favorite brand. The only fries that don't fall out of Bozo's nostrils. Oh. All right, let's put those on the funnel. The essential building blocks of life itself. Because I need to get this um, third thing on that's over here. Uh, Swillow, there were months when I lived on nothing else. There were months when I lived on nothing else. I'm sure that was healthy, Rufus. Ionized <laughs> salt. You know what they say you are what you eat. Salt. <laughs> And then fire grease. An explosion of exquisite. Ew. Oh, ho, ho. <coughs> oh. So hopefully that's enough to turn the light on. Yes. All right. So I'm not sure exactly if I need to go up to the other lab or what I need to do. This gauge is. I wonder what it. But. Because now I should be able to clone. Alright, I think I have to go into that other room. Up the stairs. Alright. So let's get heading over there, Rufus. Alright, so that's Hermes. That's Rufus. And that's an Organon. Not sure how to start this up. Huh. This gauge is different. I wonder what it means, but as long as. Okay, so I can hit the lever. Let's try making Hermes again. Because <coughs> I'm going to need him to help me restore our uh, goal. Wait! Is he seriously just going to go kill himself again? I'm going to be so mad. Don't. Seriously? Okay. Well, that didn't work. So let's see. Maybe I can click on uh, Organon. Wait. Let's try this. If I make two Hermes. Will they both just go and kill themselves? Really? Come 
Oh, so I have to make three of them, I think. I'm not sure exactly what would happen if I made an argonon. I kind of want to try it. Or if I made another Rufus. Let's see what happens. So I'm pretty sure I have to make three of them. Hermes. Let's see what happens if I make another Rufus. No way! I'm unique. More <coughs> oh, so you won't even do it. What about an Argonon? Certainly not. Thank there are more than enough of these guys. All right, so I have to make Hermes. All right, let's make three. That should work. <coughs> Sorry if my voice sounds a little get off, guys. I'm uh, recovering from a cold. Alright, so hopefully one of these will survive. That one. Alright, cool. Hey! What are you doing? Wait for me! Oh, damn it! <laughs> <laughs> Hermes the third. So I need to go talk to Hermes and um, hopefully he can help me restore gold. Just let me go! <laughs> now you know how it feels. Yes, but what else do you want? You said so yourself. All is lost. That's what I thought. But then I found gold. What were you planning? Can she be saved? Oh, you know the girl? She fell from the sky shortly after you. There was a spark of life left in her brain. The rest was pretty much smashed up. So I created a clone which survived long enough for me to perform a complete scam. Here, your lady friend could be cloned with this. Cool, now I can clone gold. Even though I have no idea of what good the pony is lost. <laughs> Just leave that to me. <coughs> Just leave that to me, Hermes. I'll make sure that the pony is lost, because I'm a goofball. Alright, let's go back to the clone lab. <coughs> I just found out. Which is gonna sound ridiculous, but if I double click that stuff teleports me. Like a French fry up a nose. Rufus, working on Gold. Can I make three of them? Mm. No image, no sound. Guess that's because some ingredients are still missing. Mm. Guess that's because Enough minerals for this. The gauge has started as that meeting. Uh oh. Alright, All right, let's do and it. In you go. I'm gonna save you gold. This is gonna be now? bad. Something's going wrong. Something's gonna be wrong with her. What? Are you doing? <laughs> One guess, I'm saving gold. But this won't work. There's no nucleic acid left in the machine. So what? It worked for you. Quick, abort the process. The pipes are overheating. The whole thing's about to blow. Uh oh. No. She's a little baby no. thing. Is that you? <coughs> she failed to mature properly. That's because of the nucleic acid. Uh oh. Where is she now? That pipe leads into the sewers under Porta Fisca. I'm so sorry, Lucas, but it looks like your girlfriend is lost forever now. No, she's alive. I can still save her. You know, I've still got some nuclear acid left. In theory, you could still use it to mature. But what about the pony? The last high boat could take off for Elysium at any moment. You cannot say go and reach the essential at the same time. And even if you could, I have the to do it. Ascension Station houses the Organon's headquarters. You'll never make it in there by yourself. But I'm not just by myself. My resistance friends are in Porta Fisco. I'll get them to distract the Organon while Gol and I sneak under the high boat. And who's going to let them know? Who will save Gol? And who will prevent Argus from leaving on the high boat in the meantime? You can't do it all. There isn't enough time. Oh for man, is it going to make me choose? And even if you could. <coughs> Split into three. Hmm. I was gonna say, can I clone Are three of myself? Sure you really want to go through with this? There isn't enough biomass left in the chamber for three clones. This way, 
At least I can serve one final purpose. <laughs> You're the ultimate cool guy, Hermes. Let's not get sentimental. Have you got the nucleic acid? Nucleic acid? Check. Very good. Remember, it won't be cloned as well. Only one of the three of you will have it when the process is finished. Don't worry, Hermes. I understood everything. You can rely on me. <sighs> I only hope your construction with the sandbags is going to work. If the lever isn't activated... It's going to work all right. It has to. In that case, let's not lose any time. Three, two, one. Here we go. Uh-oh. So now there's going to be three Rufuses, or nothing's going to happen. <coughs> well, that was lucky. Hey, it worked! Yep. What next? <laughs> One of you two needs to rally the resistance. One of you two needs to gather the rebels for a surprise attack. You do it, huh? Why me? I'm on my way to the. I'll go down to the I'll sewers. I'll go down and to the sewers Gold. and rescue Gold. But that's my job. No, no it's mine. It's my... <laughs> I'll rescue Gold. I've got the. I'll acid. rescue Gold. I've got the nucleic acid. No, I've got it. But no, Hermes gave it to me. me. Why don't we have a look? No, Ray, you took them out of there because you finished your death, not what you want. So, right. who's got the nucleic acid? Why don't you look to make sure? Who's got it? So, who's got the nucleic acid? Why don't you look to make sure? That's what they were supposed to so who's got one it? One of those two half -width. But which one? Oh man, I wish I could look right, like, by means of a cool new interface element at the lower edge of the screen. <laughs> really? <laughs> They'll be flabbergasted when I pull the nucleic. So, who's got the nucleic acid? Why don't you look to make sh- <laughs> They'll be fla- <laughs> They'll be flabbergasted when I pull the... I'm pulling out of your coat, buddy. One of those two half for which one? One of those for which one? <laughs> They'll be flabbergasted. <laughs> They'll be... <laughs> so, who's got... Why don't you look to... How do... How do what? What am I doing? <clears throat> so how do I look into my coat? <laughs> They'll be flabbergasted. So, why don't you... So, who... Why don't... <laughs> Take out the acid. She got it. There. So one of those two does this has got which one? One of those for which one of those for which Hmm. <laughs> They'll be flabbing. So, why don't you So, who's got the why don't you look to make <laughs> They'll be flat <laughs> They'll be Then pull out your coat, buddy. Oh, I'm an idiot. Hey, I'm the one with it, so I'm the one who gets to. One of those two, but which one? Alright, so take it out. There it goes. I knew it. I guess this means I'll get to save gold. Not so fast. Hey! Why are they fighting? Hey! Uh, 
Hey, they're gonna freaking destroy it. Hey! Uh, hey, stop! <laughs> it's the second mouse that gets. <laughs> it's. Hey! Uh oh. <coughs> Good job, guys. You really messed that one up. Oh crap, now we're all going down on the series. <laughs> he's gone. Oh, he's gone. So what now? Okay, I'm on the next chapter. Wow, Rufus Clone, wow, well, what do you know now? That's mind buckling news, but I'm sure so you dark. can cope. Just put on your slickers and <coughs> your knickers. <laughs> For once more, there flickers a speckle of hope. Where well, things to look black, you need someone to check. check. All the vibes at the tunnels and end if by hap. It turns out to be a cloning lab. You can prep for a quantum step. Three times Rufus, three times. So if all of them are in the sewers, they're in trouble because nobody's going to be able to get to Bozo on that. And nobody's going to be able to get onto the uh, ship. So we're kind of screwed because of Rufus fighting the other Rufuses. Gold? Is that you? Man, it's dark here. Yeah, that's cool. Gold, we have to be careful. Who knows what kind <coughs> of dangerous beasts are lurking in the dark? Yeah, her constant howl. I have to get her to come. Do you have a problem, Bozo Beer? No. Thank you, Mrs. Luke. Let the okay, so this is the other roof. I thought he needed help. I'll manage. It's just... You're afraid, aren't you, Sonny? Uh, <laughs> yes. A going party? No. At the end of the world, you moron! No, no. It's just... Uh, what is it, Bozo? It doesn't matter. Don't even think about it! Uh. Ew, really, Rufus? You who? You weren't expecting that, were you? Boy, you've really got a lot of. Oh, he's running for the hills. <clears throat> hey! It wasn't exactly pleasant for me either. So, I don't think there's anything I can do. I don't think there's anything that these guys can do. Alright, let's play with this Rufus for a little bit. Let's talk to these people, the mooks. May I bother you for a moment? Huh? Oh, look, look. <coughs> It's Baby Bozo! Baby Bozo? No, it's not. It's Rufus. That's not baby bozo. It's just a straight hobo. It's just a straight hobo. hobo. Is it now? So why do I think it's baby bozo? Because you're old uh, and senile. Excuse me, I hate to interrupt you, but... Because you're old and senile. I'm not a hobo. What are you doing in here in the middle what of a war zone? What are you doing here in the middle of a war zone? Don't you know what's going on around you? Are you still talking to that hobo woman? I'll talk <laughs> to whoever I please. <laughs> the hobo woman? Well, tell him that nothing's happening here at all these days. At least that's his the Algonon would treat it. You can tell him that you... Is that Is the that Bozo the family house over there? House over there? <coughs> Isn't this one good enough for you? It may have <laughs> a little grenade damage here and there, but it's still our home. Calm yourself, Mook. He's asking about the Bozos. Well, in that case, he's wrong here. They live next door. 
Do you know what's you up know with what's Bozo? Up with Bozo? Oh, so you're a friend of Bozo's? Nonsense, yep. Wolf. Bozo would never be friends with some random Bobo. That's because, unlike you, he has a handful of brain cells left. Even That's not very nice. This couple sounds like me and my uh, wife are gonna be like, no probably. No girlfriend, the world is coming to an end. He does so have a girlfriend. Her name is Bambina, and she lives in the floating black market. She Bambina? contradicts him as often as you do to me. I can surely understand why he moved back in with his folks. <laughs> Yeah, I'm looking, I'm for, looking the for the resistance camp. camp. Tell him we're not buying anything. The young man is looking for something, who? And so he has you of all people. You never know where you put anything. Man, at least I still have my manners. Oh, if you <laughs> had any manners, you'd take care of your guest. No, oh, the homo. Well, I almost forgot about him. Tell him that if he absolutely must go around panhandling, he should try the resistance instead. Their camp is just down the stairs and across the square after all. Those people at least know how to keep order. <laughs> just forget it. Ah, just forget. This is too <clears throat> You know, I think you were he was a hobo. That's what I said. He was a hobo after all. Alright. Let's take this clothes. Oh, I'm just moving around. The city is in ruin. Whatever, Joe. Hmm. Well, I can go down this way or I can go into Bozo's house. Let's go into Bozo's house. See if we can talk to Bozo. <coughs> huh? What the heck? What's going on here? Oh, here, Grandpa. We have visitors. Grandpa Bozo? Oh, then I better put on my bags, huh? <laughs> yeah, that's funny. <laughs> Are you a friend of Bozo? Yep. <laughs> Bozo doesn't have any friends. <laughs> I mean, that gifted tinkerer he talks about. Yep, yeah, I'm a friend me. of Bozo. Rufus. Where is the old pirate? Pirate? That chump? <laughs> chump? <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> Bozo is upstairs in his bed. What are we on a TV show? <laughs> Speaking of which, can somebody get me out of here for crying out loud? Oh! Right. What's an alien doing in here? Stuff he must be weighed down by all that junk mail. <laughs> He must be waiting on all that junk mail in his bag. Alright. Baby Bozo. <laughs> Nothing. Mama Bozo, Mama Bozo's. Mm. So, you must be Bozo's mother, right? Yes, again. His, uh, Bozo's mom is. His, uh, with his She's stepmother, fine. Uh, burglar, his parole officer. No, 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 no. His grandma, his food taster, his sister, all of the above. All Wait, of the above. Uh, what was the second to last thing you said? His sister? Oh, oh you sweet talker. Ooh. Uh, uh, why? Uh, if you want to call what? I asked if she was mom, I thought, and you said no. As in. <laughs> oh, baby. <laughs> I like where this is going. <laughs> mm. Can, Can you, you tell, tell me something, something about, about Bozo? Bozo? Of course. What would you like to know? Well, Everything. Don't open that can of words. Don't take him seriously. It's not a can. It's just a tin box where we keep the family photos. Get out of here, Rufus, before it's too late. <laughs> <laughs> I had no idea I that Bozo no had a baby that brother. Bozo has a baby brother. He's the spitting image of Bozo. He sure is, and dribbling too. That's 
because all male bozos have an exceptionally full head of hair. As soon as what about their grandpa? Oh, baby. Maybe you should use your breast milk as a... J just a minute. What was the secret ingredient to your special shampoo again? Oh. Oh. I had no idea that Rosa had such a cool mother. Such a cool mother? Oh, Rufus, you flatterer. You certainly know how to cheer up a grieving woman. Grieving? Why is she a grieving woman? Where's Bozo's dad? Missing in action. I'm beside myself with worry. I'm glad I have so much support from friends. You distract me from my what friends would that be? The yeah, what friends would that be? The plumber or the mailman? <laughs> well, you know what they say? You don't leave your good friends hanging. <laughs> Did you know that Bozo got us a girlfriend? Yeah. <coughs> yes. Her name is Bambina. She owns a weapons shop in the floating black market. Did you hear that, Grandpa? Bozo has a little lady friend. Yeah. What? That whip? Oh, poor Zozo. Yeah. Poor Bozo. Throw a few million. He's always been so shy. When I gave him the talk about the birds and the bees, he wouldn't leave the house without a beekeeper's hat. <laughs> what? Maybe we should, Maybe we should talk to someone else. It's not every day that I get to enjoy. Oh, he's not oh. down as a mailman. He's stuck in the window. <laughs> What's wrong with Bozo? Oh, Rufus, I'm at my wit's end. He's been like a different person ever since he came back. The boy who did talk. And not even his beloved Fifi Fairy Frills stories cheer him up. Fifi Fairy Frills? Fifi Fairy Frills. I'm going to make Bozo well again. You're such a nice young man. I wish I had a son. You do have a son, Bozo. Um. Can I stay for dinner? Very close, Rupert. Bozo's friends are always, especially when they look so Just so I'm sure. I'll sit at the table. Eat it and not end up as a meat dish next to the salad. <laughs> right? Okay, you make yourself at home. Meanwhile, I'll do <coughs> What was those belly lessons? Uh oh. Alright, can I go into Bozo's room? There you are. Does not look good Come at on. all. Bedtime's over. Rise and shine. What's wrong with you? But we need to Bozo. get to the rebel camp. You have to help me save the world. Bozo. <laughs> Bozo. Bozo. Alright guys, I'm going to end the video here. Hope you guys enjoyed watching this. Uh, thank you so much for checking me out. Uh, watching the video. And uh, please subscribe if you haven't already. Watch my other videos if you haven't already. And uh, you guys have an awesome day. Rest of my